Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. The AU F1 GCT, also known as the AMX 30 AU F1 or CN 155 AU F1, stands as a testament to French ingenuity in the realm of artillery systems. Developed in the late 1960s, with the first prototype emerging in 1972, this self-propelled howitzer embodies the concept of Grand Cadence de Tier, High Rate of Fire, denoted by its acronym GCT. Production of the AU F1 GCT began in 1977 and continued until 1993, with approximately 250 to 273 units manufactured for the French Army, though figures may vary depending on the source. By 2020, only 32 of these formidable howitzers remained operational. Notably, a portion of these units found their way to international buyers, with Iraq acquiring 86 units, Kuwait 18, and Saudi Arabia 63. At the heart of the AU F1 GCT lies its 155mm L40 ordnance, equipped with an autoloader capable of achieving a remarkable maximum rate of fire of 8 shells per minute. In situations where manual loading is required, the gun maintains a respectable rate of 1 to 2 shells per minute. This versatile weapon system accommodates a range of munitions, including standard and rocket-assisted HEFRAG shells, armor-piercing rounds, smoke, and incendiary projectiles. Notably, it possesses the capability to launch ADC anti-armor precision guided shells, broadening its tactical utility. The AU F1 GCT boasts a maximum firing range of 23.5 km with standard HEFRAG shells and extends to 30 km when employing rocket assisted ammunition. Housing a total of 42 shells and charges within its ammunition racks, this artillery system facilitates efficient reloads via a rear resupply hatch, a task achievable by a four person crew within a mere 20 minutes. Complementing its primary armament, the AU F1 GCT features secondary armament in the form of a roof mounted 7.62mm or 12.7mm machine gun. While its armor offers protection against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters, the vehicle incorporates NBC protection and automatic fire suppression systems to enhance crew survivability. Operated by a crew of four, comprising a commander, gunner, loader, and driver, the AU F1 GCT owes its mobility to the chassis of the AMX 30 main battle tank. Propelled by a Hispano Suiza HS 110 multi fuel diesel engine generating 720 horsepower, it delivers performance akin to its tank counterpart despite its heavier configuration. In addition to its standalone application, the AU F1 GCT turret finds compatibility with Leopard 1 or T 72 main battle tank chassis offering a modular solution for export customers seeking enhanced artillery capabilities. Although proposals for such configurations were presented, no orders materialized for these hybrid artillery systems. Furthermore, within the spectrum of French artillery, the TRF-1 emerges as a notable counterpart to the AU F1 GCT. Utilizing the same 155mm L40 ordnance, this field howitzer, introduced in 1979, has found adoption within the French army and garnered interest from international markets. In conclusion, the AU F1 GCT epitomizes the fusion of firepower, mobility, and versatility, embodying France's prowess in artillery design and production. As a stalwart in the arsenals of nations worldwide, its legacy endures through its continued service and adaptation to evolving operational requirements. That's all for now, see you later.